Hello there, my name is Karol Shima, I'm a second year medical student, it's nice to meet you. Now as part of my learning, I've been asked today to conduct an examination of your thyroid gland, which is a little gland that sits in the front of your neck. It will involve having uh, a look and feel around the neck area, and it will be tapping on the top of your chest bone, and having a listen to my stethoscope, and having a feel around the glands in your neck as well. Does that sound okay to you? Yeah, that's fine. Good, okay, so I'm just going to go quickly wash my hands. Just like to undo your top button for me. And I'll talk to the doctor as I go along. So first of all, on inspection, um, just look straight ahead for me. So there's no areas of asymmetry, no obvious goiter, um, no, scar no scars on either side, particularly in the base of the neck, and no visible pulsations either. Now, can I ask you to stick out your tongue for me, please? Okay. Okay, good. And can you put it back in? So a thyroglossal cyst would uh, move up on movement of the tongue. Now what I'd like to do is I'm going to give you a glass of water, what I need you to do is take a sip, hold it in your mouth, and then when I say, then swallow, okay? So take a sip, hold it there, okay, and now swallow. Okay, so any mass associated with the thyroid gland itself would also move up on swallowing. I'll take that from you, thank you. Now I just need to feel for your windpipe, it might be slightly uncomfortable, but it shouldn't be painful. If you're here, just let me know, okay? So, let me get a feel to see if there's any miational shift, the trachea is in the midline, that's fine. Now what I need to do is I just need to step behind you. So if you'd just like to move your head forward slightly and just look down so I can just your neck muscles relax and I'm just going to be feeling for the, the uh, thyroid gland itself. Okay? Any pain in the neck? No. No. So I'm going to feel inferior to the cricoid cartilage for the isthmus. I'm going to feel down the lateral border of the thyroid cartilage from the two lobes of the thyroid down to the base of the neck. No mass is felt. If you did suspect a mass, then again ask them to take a little sip of water. So if you could just take a sip of water, same as before, hold it in your mouth, and then swallow. Okay, so no movements with the swallowing. Um, and now I'm just going to have a feel for the uh, glands around your neck as well. Okay, so first of all, starting the mastoid process for the posterior triangle, the anterior border of the trapezius muscle. Any pain there? No. No. That's the posterior cervical, and you've got the supraclavicular, the base of the posterior triangle, the posterior border of the sternocleidomastoid, the super, super, superficial cervical, and the anterior border of the sternocleidomastoid now, the base of the neck, the deep cervical. Okay, and in the midline, this paratracheal, Submental, submandibular, preauricular, postauricular, and occipital. Okay, so no lymph node Now what I need to do is just need to gently tap on the top of your breastbone. Yeah. So the top of your chest. Okay. So I'm just going to cuss for retrosternal progression. Okay. So, no extension of the thyroid gland. And I'm just going to have a quick listen on my stethoscope as well. Okay, so listen to both lobes. Okay, so no breweries associated with thyroid storm, storm which would be a medical emergency. Okay, that's great. Thank, thank you very much. Uh, that can be my examination. You can get dressed again. Thank you. And um, are you comfortable? Yeah. Do you have any questions? No. No. Thank you very much indeed. Okay. So, so things you might want to consider when assessing a lump is whether or not it's multinodular, whether or not it's asymmetrical, um, whether it's tethered to the overlying skin or the underlying uh, muscle in the neck, um, and whether it's cystic in quality, so whether it's transluminable as well as all the other criteria for lumps. Um, normally this would actually perform the end of the thyroid status assessment. Um, this was just an examination of the thyroid plan itself. Thank you very much.